Hello beautiful people that decided to watch this video right here. This is going to be a haul on what I got when I was at the Tex the mall in Texas. And what I got at the outlet in Branson, Missouri. So the mall that I was in in Texas was in Grapevine, Texas. Where um, Cafe, Forest Cafe was at. Um, it actually was a mall and a restaurant in one. So we had decided to walk around and put, it was a big store and all of this stuff we got because it was semi-annual sale which only happens twice a year and they had some nice stuff on sale so you know we had to ball out and spend some money um the stores that i went to in texas was h&m victoria's secret pink and that's all that i got stuff from but there were more stores we went to in Branson, missouri the only store that i actually went to and enjoyed was claire's and rue 21 and that's really all so let's just get right into the video okay so the first store that we have here was from Branson Missouri we're gonna start with the cheap the shortest amount of stuff and Branson I really didn't get much from Claire's they had a three for five dollar sale and I actually only had ten dollars because my mom and stuff wasn't with me so I didn't have nobody to ask for money from but I have got this nose ring for four dollars and it's like three diamonds and a bigger diamond in the middle so it's like one of the ones you put on for like if you wanted a sept on piercing like that i think i'm gonna wear this out the video and then i got another one in gold but it's more like this and this one was seven dollars i think if this one was four dollars this one was seven dollars so i like this one better so um yep that's all we got so that was a good i put them in one because no need to carry the tiny things i also got this katy perry case it was on clearance anything that was on clearance you can get under ten dollars you could get three for five dollars and all of this these were my three items this case i got it because i really didn't need a phone case because i have a, a lot of phone cases up there and i was like well well i katy perry phone cases aren't really that cheap at Claire's so I was like I'll take my time my advantage the next store I went to was um what was the next store it was Route 21 in Branson um outlet um I don't know what part of Branson we were in but I got one of these little ball things for five for four ninety nine or five dollars that's what I spent the other half of my money on and I got my key and I got my chain on it from when I went to David Buster's in Oklahoma so I really think this is really cute. And just like once I get a car, you know, I'm be like this. Hey, babe, I'm gonna pick you up. <clears throat> anyway, the next store that I went to was in Texas, and it was right after I got my henna tattoo. I got some boyfriend jeans, and they are white, and they have like this pocket pattern thing that was like probably stitched in there by itself, and it has like all these different patterns. And then on the other side, it has like a few rips, but it's not like major rips. So, um, these are gonna. This is like some of this is back to school shopping, so I'm not gonna wear it. So this is like some back to school shopping, and one of these of the items is my boyfriend jeans that are right there. And also from Old Navy, I got some great sweatpants, but I don't really know where they are. Oh, right here. Right here, some gray sweatpants, and they have like cuffed at the ankles or whatever. It's really a big ankle, but you don't have to worry about your feet being cold because that's thick material. These, oh, I'm slow. I didn't even say the price. These pants were originally thirty-six dollars and ninety-four cents, and were marked down to nineteen, I mean fourteen ninety-nine. And these joggers were originally twenty-two dollars ninety-four cents. And we're knocked down to seventeen forty nine. Then knocked down once again for the last time, eight dollars and forty seven cent. And I love these. I feel like these are gonna be worn most of the time. They're very comfortable. And I'm buying a lot of off season stuff because once you buy on season, it's actually more expensive. Next thing I got was the next store we have here is Victoria's Secret Pink, and you can tell it's on sale because they changed the bags. So. There at Victoria's Secret, they had like tubs full of bras and it's at the sizes. So I only got two bras because usually we spend like $46 on two bras and nobody really like doing that. This is pink actually. So this is from the separate part of the store, which said pink. And 
it's like a navy blue color and then on the back it's a gray color and then on the it has a white rim that says pink around it so these bras are super comfortable it's all about the comforting the comfortableness of the bra my last bra is pink again and it has the American flag but in the pink um, symbol like or structure <coughs> and it has a white rim and it says pink too hold on let me get the door okay so we're back and I think I finished this bra and the price for this bra and the other bra same prices was originally $24.95 and went down to $12.99 so that was like 50% off you could say I don't really know I don't feel like doing the math then I also got these joggers from pink in a burgundy color they originally were $64 and were marked down to $33.99 so that was pretty good it's 50% off I think or near 50% off so they just look like this tight ankle they're more silky like than regular joggers instead of being cotton and it says pink all the way down the side to the ankle and yeah that I love these they're so comfortable boy these joggers that I'm getting can't wait for school also I got this pink tank top that was 10 that I spent $10 on which was original yeah $10.99 which was originally $26.95 and it says hello real world looks like this and this would be good to go with my joggers and it says pink at the bottom so that was a good price for a shirt because not many sh pink shirts be on price and I'm surprised that was on sale because anything that was in season it was hot in Texas that was further in season and then I got this backpack that original listen to this price it was originally supposed to be $85 okay no tax I mean no um, check sent just $85 and it was marked down to $5 they took $80 off and marked it down to 5 I feel like I'm gonna use this for a backpack it has this hook at the end this is from Victoria's Secret it has a hook at the end and you can take the hook off to get more room throughout the backpack and you can open down the bottom you can see that and the top and it's like this and it's a lot of room in it it's like so I'm thinking I can use this for like a school backpack like um when school's like in the middle of the school year because it's the first semester it's kind of busy and it has some black strings it has like a peach peachy pink triangle here and then a hot pink around here so that was a good price the last thing I got ooh, these were nicely decorated nicely decorated and they got messed up the last thing i got was a pink nation shirt if you already in pink nation you probably know that they was giving these away for free but i'm just now signing up and so therefore i have to pay for it and it's a reversible has pink nation in the inside so i love this and when we found it it was actually wrapped around in this little headband like thing that says pink it's not a headband i think it's like a wristband or something but i really don't know something so let me just put this back in the bag off camera so the next door and final store is H&M and this is probably going to be the longest because I don't I feel like I talked more throughout this part of the video and the first thing I got was a, everything in here is like a dollar and how most I spent on the product was three dollars and so they had an amazing sale so this is a medium shading brush for like eyeshadow or blending or anything you want for eyes applying and blending powders so I haven't used this I actually got another brush it was a concealer brush and it was a dollar and I used it yesterday for my um, eyebrows but I really don't want to spend time looking for it but it's like this but it's a flat top like if you were trying to do eyeliner or something and then I got five eyeshadows let's see the first eyeshadow, I think I used this one, Down to Earth. These are more Down to Earth colors because they all consist with brown or bronze color. This is Down to Earth and it's more of a blacky brown color, brown color, but it's mostly black. And there's a bus pulling up to pick up a king. But okay. And this, this is the color. So yeah. 
And these are not matte colors. They might look matte, but that's because I have put my finger through. I'm just wash it to see the pigmentation in the um, eyeshadow. And the next color I have here is Bear With Me. It's going to be brown. Like I say, it's like, it's just straight brown. And I really don't have colors like this. And it comes in really cute packaging. So, and then like what tone or whatever it is is right here so if i lose the box i can remember it and i think i might take them out the box because it's hard opening this is my favorite it's called candied almond i just feel like i'm gonna love this so much for some reason now it's like a almond caramel brown you can't really see because of the way the light is but it's really caramel like sorry for the way it appears on camera but i really like that one um this is the almost to last one and this is in the shade fig figment i really like this color for some reason i had to try it out yesterday and i really like it it has like a navy blue and a brown color and a bronze color all mixed in one so that's pretty um addicting um the last eyeshadow i got was the robusta that's a funny name eyeshadow robusta and it's like a brown color too probably a lighter brown it's kind of lighter than um bear with me i think that was the name of it like it's like a caramel color but you can't see it on camera you see my fingerprint <laughs> like down through it so and in the last things that we got was um uh the last few things that we got uh, well, i got was this brow pencil comes with a spoolie which is great to have and it comes with a brow pencil and i think i used it that's why it's a little dull and on this i would say well it's okay it's <coughs> it's um it's a little too light for me and then i got that was a dollar too and then i got these dollar fingernail polishes in like a pearl shade and we had to get two of these like because we feel like these are going to run out quick then we just got one orange color. It's pretty bright. And I feel like, oh well, there's nothing wrong with the orange every once in a while. Now, I also, this is what I spent $3 on. Was the, um, blow, I mean, brow pro kit. Okay, so this is the, <coughs> <coughs> this is the end of the video. And the last, I wanted to show the brow thing. I actually had to go get it out the bathroom. What the boo? I had to get it out the bathroom, and this is what it looks like. Um, it actually has very good um, quality. I thought it was going to be used as an eyeshadow, but it's really not. It has a wax, a black um, powder, and a brown powder. I only tried the black one out last night, and it gave my eyebrows this really pretty bold look, and I liked it. I really am excited to try the brown. Might try it after this video. And this is the brush that I got. I actually used it for concealer when filling in my brows. I used um, Elf HD Lifting Concealer to highlight my brow bone and stuff like that. And this is what it looks like. It's worth it. And so, that's all for the video. That's all for the video. Please like, comment, subscribe. Spread the word of my channel. And leave comments below of um, things that you are excited for me to try. And videos, challenges, makeup tutorials. Um, my makeup how stuff in my makeup, what's in my makeup set, anything like that. But that's all for the video. So you know what I gotta do. I gotta say goodbye, and I gotta put my hands in the camera and stop recording. So goodbye.